All right, you ever eat a filet mignon when you go out to eat? I'm gonna show you how to do it yourself. This is a seven and a half pound black Angus tenderloin. And this is what it looks like before it become, turns into that delicious little round piece on your plate when you go to the fancy restaurants. Believe it or not, a lot of this stuff on this is junk, a lot of it you keep. What I do is I usually get my hands in there and this is all excess fat. You wanna get rid of it all, all right? And it comes apart pretty easily. I just use a knife to force it a little, okay? This is what's called the chain. You wanna get rid of this, because this is all fatty, but we are gonna save it, because there is good meat in here. Just tap your knife, and you'll see where it's coming apart, and just help it along. So that's your chain. Now, I turn it over. See all that little excess fat? You wanna trim all that off. There you go, that's your tenderloin. Now let's go back to the chain because there is some good meat here. You ever eat tenderloin tips when you eat out? That's where these come from. Just go right in here. See all that? That's good meat right there. Just get rid of all the excess fat. So now we have a completely clean chain and a completely clean tenderloin chain just cut into like little cubes you know you can saute these up with mushrooms onions you know throw a little wine in there make some nice tenderloin tips you could also grill them if you like you got got your pile of tips put those off to the corner you got your tenderloin ready to be cut for steaks i usually like cutting them at around six to eight ounces they cook better so you got that piece right there that's the tenderloin that's a tenderloin. There you go, you got your fillets now. Now we got 11 steaks, we're gonna take them over to the grill and we're gonna cook one up perfect, medium rare. I'm gonna hit it with a little bit of seasoning salt. Once I flip it over on the grilled side, I'll throw some garlic butter on there. A lot of your fancier places do add butter to their steaks. 